Hi, I'm Vicky. I'm a veterinary physiotherapist and I'm also the therapy manager here at Equilibrium Products. The Equilibrium Therapy Massage Mitt is a great way to give your horse a little massage. Um, it's quite a versatile tool, so we're going to go through a few different ways that you can use it to help benefit your horse. Um, so when I first put it on the horse, I'd always have it switched off and I'd always go for sort of the shoulder wither area just because it's an area that the horses are quite used to being touched. So um, we just put it straight on the horse, then I'd turn it on, it automatically comes on to low and then I'd just switch up onto medium for an all over massage. she doesn't seem too worried about it so I'll start the massage and I always tend to start up the neck and work my way back towards the, the hindquarters. So for an all over massage I generally use the 10 minute cycle split between both sides of the horse so generally spending five minutes either side working on the main key muscle groups. So they would be on the neck, down onto the forelimb, onto the triceps, along the back, onto the hindquarters, and then down onto the hamstrings. always looking at the horse to see what their reaction is, if they're enjoying it or if they're a bit worried. Um, Jenny seems to be enjoying it, she's got her ears to the side. So then we're just moving on to the other side to carry on with our all over massage, spending about one minute in each of the key areas. targeted areas. So we know that horses that are in ridden work tend to get quite tight in the neck um, and normally that's sort of along the top line, sort of the rhomboid area. Um, and generally this tends to be because we're not necessarily asking the horse to work in a way that is completely natural for them, so they strengthen in areas that they maybe wouldn't normally. So turn it on again, starting up the neck, working down onto this area and then turn it back up onto medium and up onto high. Generally then hold it there for about two to three minutes judging on their reaction and after about two to three minutes just work over the area to help disperse any toxins that you may have made. So Jenny here has got a little trigger point in her back, um, which is just a tight area of muscle. Um, so we're going to press and hold on there and see if we can get a bit of a release from, from Jenny. Um, so again, just introducing it onto the neck, work your way down until you get to the area. Then I'm going to turn it up onto high and just press and hold there for five to ten minutes depending on how she reacts. I'm hoping to see that she might even lean into it or at least drop her head, relax her ears, may even see some licking and chewing from her mouth. She's just um, resting her back leg now so she's obviously quite comfortable. They seem to be reacting to it okay, you can actually start to lean some of your body weight into it. 